This is KMTV 3 News Now. I'm Melissa Curtis of 3 News Now. Here's a look at what's happening now. Omaha police have arrested a man in connection to the vandalism at the Bob Carey Pedestrian Bridge. 42-year-old David Orlowski was arrested Friday evening in connection to the destruction of property investigation at the bridge. He was arrested for felony criminal mischief greater than $5,000. Orlowski has an outstanding felony warrant for a similar charge out of Council Bluffs. Omaha Public Schools is conducting interviews this upcoming week to fill a vacancy on the board. According to our news partners, the Omaha World Herald, Evan, Evan Schmeitz and Margot Juarez will be interviewing on Monday to fill the Subdistrict 8 seat. The position opened last month after former board member Kamara Snipes resigned due to, the mo to moving out of the district. The board meeting will start at 5.15 p.m. Monday at the TAC building. Candidates will be interviewed before the board members vote. The chosen candidate will then take an oath of office before the rest of the meeting continues. And I'm 3 News Now, weather alert meteorologist Audra Moore with this weather update. We'll get to enjoy a bit more sunshine again on Sunday. And that, along with breezy southwest winds, will help us to warm back up into the low and mid-50s across most of the area, especially along into the south of I-80. It will be a few degrees cooler up to the north, highs in those mid to upper 40s, where there's a little bit more snow still left on the ground. But we'll do more melting as we go throughout the day on Sunday. Then heading into Sunday night, once the sun sets, temperatures start to drop. Most of us are going to be back down in the 20s by the time you're getting ready to head out the door on Monday morning. But Sunday afternoon here in Omaha, a high of 53 degrees. Those southwest winds at times gusting up to about 30 to 35 miles per hour. But the winds overall will be backing off as we go throughout the day. But the warming trend, that is going to continue. Monday, basically a repeat of Sunday. Not quite as breezy, though, back in the low and mid-50s. Upper 50s, near 60 degrees by Tuesday afternoon, close to 70 on Wednesday and looking at setting a new record high there. It'll be a windy day too. And then when the cold front comes through, brings a chance for a few rain showers along with it. And that'll drop us back down into the mid 40s through Thursday and Friday, then 30s by next weekend.